after a while, Miss Chavez, she just, she rose up and she was the supreme queen ruler of this school and she just, she runs this place. Where's the paperwork you asked for? Huh. It's pretty scary. Yeah, I'm still here. I'm an undercover cop, you know, no big deal. Just making sure all the kids are in line, you know. Okay, so you, you guys want to do anything fun this weekend? You know, maybe against the rules a little bit? Like, try something out? A little bit, no? Anybody? <laughs> they don't even know. They think I'm a student. I just keep telling people I'm getting held back for football. Don't even question it. Hey, you uh, got any knives? No. All right, kids, time for class. Now see on this graph over here, the fourth square to the fifth of the 94th <laughs> makes this shape right here. first took this job, in my mind, I just, my role model was Coach Scott. So first, the square root brings that over here and down here, and then it makes it come down to this part of the graph, and then the two uh, other square roots make that and therefore you have a parabola and then the vortex yes that makes a math problem you understand class does everyone understand no um, I, I read the book coach Scott 101 it really inspired me of how to be a teacher and love the kids Treat them with respect and make sure that they understand everything they learn. Even if I don't make that much sense, but it works out in the end. I incorporated yoga into my curriculum 20 years ago. And you have to hold the pose and feel your feet going through the ground. This is kind of like how we have the Warsaw Pact and NATO. And it keeps me young and vibrant. And especially when the, we do the Proud Warrior, because we are the warriors. All right, so chapter 52, absolutely no talking right now. Yeah, so I, I used to be known as pretty chill, but 30 years teaching kids will just kind of drive you crazy. Now it's just zero tolerance for anything that they do. That's the only way to have absolute, total domination of a class. Are you seriously talking? Okay, questions one through 500. It's so like talking demerits. Uh, on your phone, in school suspension. I mean, passing a note, we're gonna expel you, basically. Questions one through 500, do by the end of class, seriously. Uh, can we do like one through five hundred like evens? No, oh, seriously! Did I say even? Ah! Yeah. Okay, entonces vamos a practicar con el contraste entre el... It got really taxing and hard to, to teach to very large classes, so I thought, you know, the easiest solution to this is Smaller class size. Negativo con el subjuntivo. Aquí hay unos ejemplos entre perfecto, presente. And as you can see, it works perfectly.